Welcome to the Tianshan Channel, the original video platform of the movie, Wusong Fighting Ximen Ching, to be talked about today is launched, and officially premiered. The name of the movie already contains the content, which is the story of Wu Da, Wu Er, Pan Jinyan, and Ximen Ching. This story was, born out of the Chinese classical novels, Water Margin, and Jin Ping Mei. In the two classics, the fate of several people is different. Wu Song fights to kill Ximen Ching, uses the, Water Margin, story. Looking at the film, it is really a remake of Wu Song, in Water Margin. The content of the story lacks a basic sense of innovation. Of course, the film was not completely remake, but added a plot that was not in the original Water Margin, that is, the impoverished children Wu Song had been helping, turned out to be Ximen King's student for medical expenses, and began to hunt down Wu Jiro. This is also the only original content in the movie, Wu Song fights to kill Ximen Ching. The film is straightforward, starting with Pan Jinyan and Ximen King's secretive affair, to Wu Song's business trip, to Wu Delang being poisoned, and finally a series of revenge actions by Wu Song. This movie can even be called ridiculously, and does not require a screenwriter to participate in the work. Of course, the story of Wu Do's second Pan Jinyan Ximen King has been prosperous in film and television dramas, and it is really worth thinking about. Many of our film and television drama s are keen on this, but in fact they just use Pan Jinyan as a film and television symbol. This film and television symbol is pinned on the shameless imagination of some creators. And most of these film and television dramas with Pan Jinyan as the content will shoot some scenes that do not have there to appear. When we watch Wu Song Opera, what are we watching? For Wu Song fights to kill Ximen Ching, it is obvious that the contents of some of Pan Jinlin's skins are regarded as important points. Especially in conjunction with some of Ximen King's dramas, it is just to create something UNN, atricious for the audience. Visual junk is nothing. This type of work actually did not go deep into the effective philosophical level to explore Pan Jinlin's spiritual world. Although our film and television series like to film Pan Jinlian scenes, they lack the ability to explore Pan Jinlian's spiritual world, and lack the humanistic care of female characters in a deeper dimension. In Wu Song Fighting to Kill Ximen Ching, Pan Jinlian is no more than interpreted as a little lady who wants to have her birthday. Obviously, the establishment of this kind of personality does not conform to the behavior motives of the characters in the film. A little lady who wants to be safe, why bother to poison Wu Delang? Because of the lack of more advanced humanistic care in the film, the rationality of the characters in the plot cannot be discussed. For the heroine Ge Tian, she once at, acted much attention because she was the ex-wife of a certain athlete. However, the two people who have now divorced do not seem to have to lift each other in this way. The Pan Jinlian presented by Ge Tian in this movie, because of the thinness of the script, caused the thin characterization. T. This has little to do with the acting level of the actors themselves. On the contrary, within the scope of actors' ability, the TN also let the audience see the image of an actress with acting skills. Of course, there may still be fans criticizing the beauty of Gertian's Pan Jinlian. The old Ed Itall believes that in our established thinking, the three words, Pan Jinlian, are always labeled as beautiful and shameless. This is an aesthetic orientation under the subculture of sadomasochism. Why is Pan Jinlian so beautiful that it satisfies the imagination of some movie fans? Ge Tian's Vaisi on of Pan Jinlian seems to be not good enough in appearance, but as long as the actors pass the acting skills, others don't need to be too harsh. In the movie, Wu Song fights to kill Ximen Ching, although the literary and opera part is flat and straightforward, the water margin is repeated boo. T the martial arts part is more exciting. In the recent two years of online movies, this problem is common there are loopholes in the script level, but it can achieve ultra-high standards in the shooting of specific scenes, fierce fighting, shocking special effects and so on. Obviously, this movie takes the route of fierce fighting. For online movies, it is not difficult to make martial arts scenes more shocking. It is just to hire professional martial arts actors and professional martial arts instructors. At present, there are a lot of Waji teams in China, and they are all very high leave. L. Online movies can always do a good job of facades. The martial arts are good, the special effects are good, and the film itself is decorated very well. However, within the facade, at the level of the content of the story, it is broken. 
this is still rich and not spent on the blade. The real, lifeblood of a movie is still the script. It just decorates its own appearance, shoots high-quality dramas, and produces superb special effects, but it is only the children of the rich who bought a few more sets of clothes. 4. Wu Song fighting Simon Ching, if you can make a fuss about the origin, ality and depth of the script, the quality of the film may be improved by an order of magnitude. This is a problem with the film, and a common problem with online movies. When listening to the title, the audience will naturally think of, Water Margin, and of course, Jinping MEI. Both classic, S have Wu Song story. Of course, the story of, Wu Song, fighting to kill Simon Ching, is naturally familiar to everyone. It is undoubtedly a difficult task to make new ideas, based on stories familiar to the public. For an online movie, it is even more difficult. Looking at the movie, Wu Song, fighting to kill Simon Ching, it is obviously difficult to come up with new ideas, and it naturally falls into the stereotypes. Wu Song fights and kills Simon Ching, obviously focuses on, how to fight and kill Simon Ching. The story about Simon King's, poisonous killing of Wu Delan with Pan Jinli, and An Huang Po is obviously secondary, and even how Pan Jinlian, had an affair with Simon Ching step, by step was downplayed. Of course, these can be briefly described as a film, but it makes the whole story, a lot thinner, and a lot of love, for children is missing. In addition, the relationship between E.N. Wu Song and his sister-in-law was not presented more intuitively, and the relationship between Wu Song and his brother was not well prepared. Perhaps the director thinks that the audience is not familiar with these anymore. But as a film, without details, the so-called emotional changes of T, he characters will come out of nowhere, and everything will become illogical. In the end, what we see is playing. Hit from start to finish. At first it was to save the subordinates, and then it was for revenge. However, in the film, Simon King's strength is really extraordinary, and three G.O. Ups of people have been invited to get rid of Wu Song. The character of Simon Ching is also the most vividly portrayed in the film. Although a lot of the previous affair with Pan Jinlian was missing, after the final poisonous killing of Wu Delang, the attitude towards Pan Jinlian and Wang Poshao Dias what Simon Ching was like. And the repeated sending of people to get rid of Wu Song is a testament to Simon King's cruelty. For Wu Song's characterization, besides fighting, he is fighting. However, Pan Jinlian's appearance does not seem to be recognized by the public, and it is even more R, uh, regarded as the ugliest Pan Jinlian. In the film, Pan Jinlian plays Ge Tian. The name is somewhat familiar, yes, she is Liu Xiang's ex-wife. Apart from the much concern about the marriage with Liu Xiang, the public doesn't know much about this actor. Ge Tian starred in six major cases for, later it was an online movie. As the story of Wu Delang, Pan Jinlian is undoubtedly the most concerned by everyone. There are dozens of Pan Jinlian images in film and television works. Someone has done statistics, as many as 25 versions, so many naturally improve the audience's aesthetics. La, Tecomas want to surpass the predecessors, naturally it is not small. Such as the 96 version of Water Margin, played by Wang Xiaoi, Pan Jinlian, left a deep impression on people. The eyes, nose, mouth and eyebrows are more in line with the original image. There is also Gan Tingting in the new version of Water Margin, for which she won the Best New Actress of the Year at the 2011 Chinese Opera Festival. So with the performance of these predecessors, it is naturally difficult for late commas to break through and surpass. Now in Wu Song fights to kill Simon Ching, although the focus I is not on Pan Jinlian, it is inseparable from Pan Jinlian. In the film, except for her heavy makeup and a red dress, there are not many highlights. On the whole, Wu Song fights to kill Simon Ching is a third-rate internet level, well-known story that does not require much interpretation, so the film is mainly based on fighting. Even so, it makes people feel sleepy. Remakes of masterpieces and classics are understandable, but in familiar stories, how to win by surprise is undoubtedly the most important thing, not just to interpret what remains on the surface. Of course, over-adaptation will deviate from the original work, and will become the four different things, and the intact copying will fall into stereotypes, so it is undoubtedly a difficult task for the remake of the classic. If you like my video, please like and subscribe. Thank you for watching the next movie. Goodbye.